So for something like ransomware, so we drilled into that scenario here, and we're looking at kind of that drill down beneath that top level value at risk. And what we have are individual actions that an adversary can take that are prioritized by their current risk that they're carrying, and then the amount of risk that can further be reduced given the investments that you already have within your technology stack. And that, again, could be something like your cloud provider, security tooling, SaaS applications, we're ingesting all these different knobs and levers to try to understand how they're interacting with each other. And just to give you a visual aid in terms of what that looks like, we're gaming out the entire scenario from that adversarial lens. Uh, you know, if you kind of walk out a ransomware incident, it starts with an adversary first gaining access to your network, discovering some stuff, establishing privilege escalation, and then eventually encrypting a lot of your data. And each of those is basically just a, a logical gate that that adversary needs to pass. And we're scoring each of those uh, and then threading the needle to, to figure out what the ultimate likelihood is of that uh, scenario in question. We can then get down into a pretty good level of fidelity pointing to specific products and then configurations or policies that have a, um, a role within uh, yeah, a spike in risk or also opportunity to reduce risk as well. 